I'm Sage Catabriga Alosa, and you're watching Behind the Line. Scientists in my brain are crunching numbers like super fast, trying to do calculations to see how hard you should pop and when to pop. And you just know the mo before it happens, you can tell. I was like, this is the chance. Here we go. The flat spin. Unleash the flat spin right now. You know, Sage is definitely one of the more progressive athletes in the world. This year, you know, Sage was trying to work on a bunch of new tricks. He was working on a flat spin. He was working on double flips. Been trying to, you know, change it up a bit this year and started learning some backflips and then a variation of the backflip. All right, drop it! Yesterday, I decided to try it off this one pillow and I kept landing firm and didn't land it three times. Kind of beat myself up. And today, I found another pillow that kind of had a nice kick on it, and I tried it, and I uh, felt real good to land one. And then I kind of went tomahawking into the woods after I landed yeah. it, but it still felt good. Whoa, man and tree. I continued to kind of work on it and practice it. Really started to just build some confidence and, and get comfortable with it. Typically, when Sage is working on a new trick, he's working on that so that he can bring that into the total natural environment and throw it kind of in the in the mix and in the middle of lines. Ended up trying to do a double flip and got my first one. Double backy-ish thing, super stoked, what a day. Eventually we were in Alaska and I was feeling like, man, I'd love to do a flat spin off a of feature in Alaska. Let's take a look at that mini spine wall. Straight ahead pretty much, right? Yeah, 12 plus. Most of the time in Petersburg it was sketchy and gnarly and couldn't find too many places and then all of a sudden we found the gem of all gems which was a spine line into a crevasse gap and it was one of those things I didn't really know if it would work and we took a really close look in the heli and kind of well looks like it might work. Okay we're going live. excitement of the first run and the prep of the first run got me into a zone, into a moment where I felt it. I mean, it's funny, like, the, the correlations that, like, video game have, you know, where, they, like, your special meter gets higher and higher, and then once your special meter is ramped, like, you can do crazy tricks, it's kind of the same. When that thing is pinging, you know it, and you feel it, and it's time to go. And had all the preparation of the year up to that of like learning and dialing in that new trick there's no way that I would have been comfortable to just try it after a spine line off a you know, natural feature that had never been hit. 